It's a rest day, Sunday, so all I need to do is hit cardio um, and then that's me done. So I'm just going to do a 5 minute warm up, 15 minutes of hit, so I can do 15 seconds at 100% as hard as I can and then 45 seconds at 50%. take my specs off because I'm such a specky fucker. It is Monday. My first day back at work since I've been off for a week. Fucking depressing but hey ho. Um, so I've just changed legs. That session consisted of leg extensions, heavy as fuck to failure. Banded hack squat, doing different kind of reps and shit. Really heavy leg, well leg press doing like a set of 20 reps and then a set of 50 reps. And then do walking lunges until you fucking die. I died. And then it was a doctor machine with four points of failure. Single lion leg. Oh my god, I can't even speak. Single leg lion hamstring curls. Does that make sense? Um, back to the doctors to do four triple points of failure again. And then straight into 45 degree hyper. Finished off with calves. So, um... I felt it was quite a good session actually, and I've got the fucking belly out. Belly's out. Ugh. To be fair, it's, it's not that dreadful. It's just when I sit, my leggings like roll down. So, look, like that, I'm sat. Anyway, I'm actually, you can tell I've had a good session when I'm just hyper and talking utter bollocks. So, yeah, that was really good. No pain. So, back's fine, hamstring's fine. Um, my weight today, I will just tell you because I've started tracking it daily. So I'm sitting at 66, so that's been a week now, exactly, and I've lost one pound two kilo. Um, so see how this week goes now that it's like I've had one full week of being on plan. Um, and we'll see how this week goes now that I've not, like, I'm not recovering from, like, days of eating shit. So I feel like, am I, am I burnt? I really need, oh god, that's dreadful. Oh. So yeah, feeling good. It's a medium carb day, so hence why I'm so chilly. Um, I don't actually have a post workout, I have intra carbs. Uh, so I'll go home and I'm just going to have my turkey with my veg. And then before I go to bed, it's not usually before I go to bed, it's usually like an hour after I've had my dinner. I'll have a casein shake with peanut butter, which I actually love. I've got the bulk powders casein protein and it's in chocolate. And literally is the thickness of a milkshake. It's so tasty. I've got... I'm in the office Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I don't think I'm working any funny lates. And then Friday, I'm doing an Edinburgh for a team building thing where there's obviously lunch booked at a fucking burger place. So I've emailed them to ask them, can I bring my tubs, please? Because they don't even do any steak or anything. So I'll, there's literally nothing in the menu that I can have. It's all burgers. Like It's literally all burgers. Um, so I'll wait and see what they say. So that's annoying, but what can you do? So yeah, I'm going to go home, have a dinner. Oh shit, sorry. Hi. Bye, do the castle cup. No, don't run away, you'll love me. Ow, love me. I am actually thinking, like, I, f I feel like I smell like I'm burning. Shite. Shite is burning. Um, prep thoughts today. I'm hungry as fuck, because it's low carb day. So that's basically two lots of 30 gram oats, 50 grams of sweet potato. Now, if you're really interested to what 50 grams of sweet potato looks like, you should you should just cut some up because it's literally two bits of fucking potato. Um, so I'm super hungry. 
yeah, I'm really hungry, but tomorrow's high carb day, so that's good. Um, and then Friday I'll have another low carb day, Saturday will be my cheat, and then Sunday will be a rest day, but with medium food, which is awesome. No, a good week so far. Um, I've got, I'm, I'm training hamstrings again tomorrow, which I'm dreading, um, but Shannon, my sports massage, is coming to house on Friday to sort me out and help me look at what I need to correct and stuff. Um, so that'll be really good. I'm looking forward to getting that wee body kicked in. Yeah, good week. Nothing else to report. No crazy preparedness yet, apart from I want penguins. I haven't had a penguin in about 10 years, but I want one now. Because uh, somebody had them in the office, so naturally I'm like, give me a bit of that. Um, but yeah, apart from that, we all gold. You're about to see a nail transformation. Let's look at the state of these fuckers. They've actually lasted quite well. Right, you ready? Right now it's two minutes past nine across the UK. It is finally time for Believe it or not, these are a, a request for them to be shorter. For everybody that's asking, I go to um, get a Lindsay who is at, at on Instagram at Beauty by Lindsay. Um, I'll tag her on my Instagram so then you can see these, but she is amazing. So if you're near the Paisley area, or Glasgow actually, because I travel for good shit. I love these. Very not me, don't get colours, but I like these. Mind I was saying about the 50 grams of sweet potato thing. Well, look at this. Who's that even going to fill? What's the end point in that? What the fuck? I'm so tired. I look like an actual gypsy. I'm gonna go sleep now. It's been a long day and no carbs. Well, low carbs. But so, tomorrow I get Nando's. Oh, I'm so warm. I have just done my 30 minutes fast and cardio. Um, so I've weighed myself today, and so this is Saturday, so it's my check-in day. So last Saturday I was 65.4, and today I'm 64.2, so just over a kilo off, which is good. So I'm just going to take my check-in, blah, 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 blah. I'm just going to take my check-in pictures, um, send them over to Rosie, and we'll just see, see what we think, really. Hopefully I'm still getting a Nando's tonight. Please get a Nando's. So yeah, um, I'll do a check-in, and you can have a look and see what you think. Checked in with Rosie and she had said um, much better, quads are so much bigger this year. I said, I'm really happy with how they're looking and she said yeah your body's coming in tighter now, it's exciting to see the muscle um, and then she's just asking how it's feeling and stuff. I am so tired, I think a couple of low carb days in the trot just fucking kills me man. Like, so I've just been napping. <sighs> but, so yeah I can see earlier so I've been planning for like a couple of weeks, this is going to sound so ridiculous right, because it's just what it is, but if you die, this will be like, you'll understand how good this is. Because Stephen helped me get my car and stuff, I wanted to like, I guess repay him, or say thank you. Um, so I contacted his coach to find out when he'd be next, like getting a cheap meal. Um, so Stephen's been like, on a really, like I guess, low food diet for the last four weeks, so 
almost a bit of like a shock to the system and then he's going to get his calories back up and then he'll start dieting. So this has been like a really tough week because this has probably been the hardest it's been in the lowest food he's been on. Anyway, so I spoke to his coach and we are like, right, I want to surprise him with the cheat meals. Don't let him know he's getting a cheat meal. Like, I want to surprise him with it. So his coach, his coach decided to tell me he was fasting today. Um, so Stephen being saying like, oh man, I just hope he tells me I can get a cheat. I just want a Nando's, I just want a Nando's. Um, and then he checked in this morning and, and his coach said, no, you need to fast, but no training or cardio. So my plan is I'm going to go get it's Nando's, so he wants a whole chicken and penny chips. This is the useful thing about dieting. You're very open about what you want, so we've been talking about it a lot, so I know exactly what he wants. Um, so I'm going to get him his Nando's, and then I'm going to surprise him with it and let him know that he can have it. And he is going to be... I think he might cry, actually. I genuinely think he might cry. <sighs> so, I'm trying to, like, not train until later. It's quite past 12 just now. Um, only because I'm just going to sit and do fuck all and I'll just be like one to eat. So, I'll maybe train like mid late afternoon and then I've got two meals left before I have my Nando's. I'm going to have my frozen, my frozen local ice cream again. But just now I'm just going to watch the and chill because I'm so tired. It's actually far too warm here. I'm just going to do some shoulders and... Um, shoulders and arms, a bit of push and then... I'm looking back on our time And we just couldn't get it right I wish somebody would have told me That everything would change I'm finally seeing it clear and I know just what you are I wish somebody would have told me That the bed feels warmer than it ever did When you were by my side And now I don't have much, but baby Now I got my pride and my stride And my heart side, hey I'm 20, 20 in hindsight And oh, you let me down, but I got up all by myself You help me live and learn that I don't need nobody else Hey, through the hot time I'm 2020 in the side I wish somebody would have told me That everything would change I'm finally seeing it clear And I know just what you are I wish somebody would have told me yeah. That the bed feels warmer than it ever did When you were by my side And now I don't have much, but baby Now I got my pride and my stride And my heart side, hey I'm 20, 20 in hindsight And oh yeah, let me down, but I got up all by my Twenty twenty in the side. Oh, are you sleepy as well? Rah. So I'm just getting ready to go to Nando's. I've timed it so that I should be in just as Stevens arrived home. Like I should come home just as Stevens arrived. So <laughs> the poor fucker thinks he's getting a rice cake and a quarter of whey every hour tonight, and that's it. Oh man, nothing for him. 
He's going to lunch, so be so excited. So I've ordered them. I told chicken and his chips. I've got my bag of Doritos and um, salsa, so he's going to be so happy. So I'm going to drive over, get her shit, and come home. So excited. Okay, so mission, mission Nando's. I'm just in. Like, so there's my wee butterfly, his big chips, his whole chicken. I got him some Doritos, and I got him some gums. And he has no idea. So I thought he'd been before me, but he's nipped to the shops. So let's just keep an eye out, keep an edgy. Oh, he's gonna be so happy. Where the fuck is he? I'm hungry, I will eat. Eyes closed. Eyes closed, eyes closed, eyes closed, eyes closed. Eyes closed. Hey. Guess who's not fasting tonight? Can I make it? Yeah. Huh? I've only fasted. How long? It was all a big lie. <laughs> I'm ready for this. You've got a whole chicken to eat. Fuck off, have I? Mm -hmm. You talking to Stephen, eh? Mm -hmm. Class. <laughs> <laughs> How excited are you? What was that feeling like knowing that you were going to eat? What? What was your feeling like knowing you were going to eat? I just been mentally prepared all day I was going to. You're eat. eating? From take that away? It's CJ, and it's even taken away. I think I'd still be able to do my shit. I'm getting that. Better shut the fuck up. How the fuck do you want this? Oh my god. Yeah, I'm eating the leftovers. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Happy days, man. Thanks very much. You're welcome. How are you feeling post Nando's? Well, sorry. Halfway through your Nando's, pussy bitch. Apocalyptic. <laughs> You're actually sweating. I'm sweating. I'm out of breath. Can you tell everybody what you called me? A fucking animal. I'm a fucking animal because? I've never seen somebody put away <laughs> food and fucking leave me standing like that before. I am an animal. I am a lean mean. Well, I am a to be lean mean eating machine. A to be lean <laughs> yeah. machine. And now dessert. Which is all mine, all mine. Oh, my nails match. Right, let's sign off. Signing off the vlog because I'm going to go and eat my ice cream. And we're going to go and watch films. And Stephen's going to eat all of the food that I bought him. So that I don't eat it. Because I want to eat it all. Say bye, Stephen. Bye, Stephen. <laughs> bye.